Many years ago my owner went on a trek through the jungle. He walked all day in the heat. Finally he got to a little village. What happened then? He was welcomed like a king. He got good food to eat and a special place to sleep. It was a beautiful night. Then he went to bed. He got sick. He had the runs very badly. And vomiting. With a high fever. He was in the loo all night. Ouch. Sounds awful. What happened in the morning? My owner walked back home the day with diarrhea and vomiting. He made many stops in the bush. He was very sick for days after that. Things were very different then. No communication with home. He had no way to get any help. The only thing he could do was put his head down and walk. It was a nightmare. Expatriate life has changed because of the smartphone. All the apps with information. Medical advice. Games. Help. I wish I had been in his back pocket during that trip. He could have called home. Gotten medical advice. Directions about the shortest way home. I could have shined my light in the loo for him, which would have made things easier. The only thing I could not do is be toilet paper for him. There is no app for that. Do you have the Expatriate Everyday Support Center app for smartphone? No I do not. What does the application do? It is support in your sweaty hand. Or dusty pocket. Or smart suit. Tips for expatriate life. Interviews. Schedule of events. Keep a journal. Connect with other expatriates. There is even a panic button when you have a panic attack. Something for those minutes in the loo. How much does the app cost? It is free. You can download it on Apple or Android. Thanks for telling me about it. The next time we're in the loo I will download it. Just remember. There still is no toilet paper application.